All right, everybody. Uh, I'm gonna be off traveling tomorrow, so I thought I'd try and make a quick packing video for you. Um, yeah, hopefully it'll be useful. Um, plenty of my friends will come traveling. Here's what I'm taking. Um, I basically based this off a lot of things that I looked up online um, and kind of catered it to myself. Uh, Try to make it as light as possible. Uh, I've heard from a lot of places that, you know, um, after a couple of years of traveling, they've wanted uh, a lot less stuff. So I've gone for about 40 litre backpack, um, 40 litre plus 10. Um, yeah, trying to keep it as light as possible. Technology is probably the only thing weighing me down, but I like it. It's going to stay with me. Um, okay, yeah, I mean, this stuff is going to be mainly for the hot countries. Uh, I'm going to be going to Malaysia, Thailand, and Australia. And uh, yeah, it's pretty much catered for that. I've got a whole other backpack for a uh, suitcase for, uh, for Japan and working. Um, all right, yeah, I'll show you around my bag. So, um, first of all, you'll see I quite like packing cubes. These things are very good. Um, just means that all my stuff is contained now. Um, you know, I've, I've even got little bags inside the bags. Uh, it just means I don't lose anything. Um, I know where it is. And uh, some of them have got little pull tabs. So I can just like dig into my bag. They all fit nicely and square together in my bag. I just pull them out. And uh, yeah, it's just easy. It's quick. Um, I don't mind emptying my bag and filling it back up again. Um, so that's probably going to be my day bag as well. I'm just going to uh, take what I need out lock it up and t yeah take that everywhere um, small light useful um, yeah so these packing cubes pretty useful I'll show you uh, this is my clothes one I think this comes from Japan I'm hoping to get another one for like a little half and half one um, when I'm over there again for kind of like uh, just like your dirty washing and stuff and um, right, so in here, I've just got a jumper, um, there's, a, there's a few t shirts, uh, a couple shorts, and I've been told it's quite good to have. So, you've got like a shirt, um, kind of a quick drying shirt there, and another quick drying one here, it's a polo shirt. So, they kind of they're all different, but they've got their own uses. Um, and then, even with the even with some of the boxes, but it's a special material, so. It's um, breathable, so hope that would be nice. Uh, yeah, and just some trekking trousers. My main pair of trousers there. I might change that. Hopefully, I'll uh, go to Thailand and get some nice kind of like airy hippie threads, and that'd be good. Um, yeah, that's pretty much all for here. Um, right, what else you got? So, trekking towel. Um, this is Trespass one. Pretty much the cheapest one um, I could find. On eBay, uh, antibacterial, quick drying, the right size, it's good. Uh, what's that? That is uh, just a waterproof jacket. Um, the only other thing I've got is a hoodie uh, if it gets cold, and the other jumper. Uh, so, just got a nice lightweight one of these for dirty washing, take that to laundry or whatever. Flip flops, of course. Um, I do have some trekking shoes somewhere, but they're downstairs. Uh, what else we got? So my packing cubes, I mean this one is pretty much just uh, my little bits of Lego for messing around with. And some, yeah, a few other bits and pieces. There's a little Benny. Right. Uh, and here, got a load of cables, just charging cables really, splitters. Um, yeah, just all the loose bits that need to be kept together. Um, but this this thing is pretty important. I like this. Um, just an external battery, about 1,200 milliamp hours, um, and it all charges through the same as what I charge my phone. So I minimise my cables there. Um, I only need this cable. This will charge that. My phone. I can charge other things from here. Um, I've actually made my. I've got. GoPro charger that's down here. Um, has the same kind of fitment. 
and it just means that yeah you can charge them a lot easier you can charge them from my battery pack or as well as my solar panel um, well, that should be really handy if I go trekking um, I don't know just get stuck out somewhere I like my power um, what else we got uh, okay in here we have this thing's pretty good um, so I've had smaller versions of this I think I still got some left in here all it does is let you plug in USB devices so there's a smaller version that's my old one I think it went a bit broken but it lets you plug this into your phone and uh, then I can plug like my hard drive um, and my GoPro uh, or uh, micro SD cards for these little things um, and then basically this is what I will be attempting to blog off and do everything off I'm not take my laptop uh, it's lighter, smaller, less to steal um, hopefully it should do everything I'll get back to you on that uh, or not if it fails um, yes yeah, so that's really handy it means I can take things from the GoPro into here then straight back out onto the hard drive so I'm not clogging things up uh, I like that a lot you can even charge from it um, or for another alternative there's this thing which you can plug a, uh, an SD card into um, and it's got an end to fit in here and an end to fit into your computer so it does kind of three jobs in one pretty good uh, hard drive there uh, in this this little packing cube got you know, a deck of cards to keep keep uh, entertained when you go to the pub or something uh, just a little, little camera a uh, kindle and a travel journal um, yeah I've just taken up reading um, so I'm quite looking forward to my well I've got probably a free three day journey tomorrow um, but yeah, do some reading. Uh, I actually looking forward to to waiting around now. Kindle is definitely advised for travelling. Uh, in here, I've got my pretty much my wash bag and first aid kit. So it's got some few drugs and things in there. So I don't need to worry about getting them in another country. Well, if I'm in pain, I can work that out later on. Uh, then there's a little sewing kit in there in case anything breaks. Um, filled up with some uh, stolen hotel shampoo, of course, too. Um, what else have we got in here? Ah, uh, yeah, been told Barack is a good one to take. Managed to get some uh, some free some free mango ones um, just by signing up something. Um, yeah, so make me feel better in the morning sometimes. Uh, ah, yeah, I was advised to get just a little inflatable travel pillow. One of those uh, things to go over your eyes, and some earplugs in case I'm on a really horrible train journey or flight. Um, yeah, it might help. Uh, it doesn't take up much too much space. Right, and then in here, it's mainly all my GoPro bits. I uh, got a head torch in case you do some trekking. It's also got a nice kind of red light, which is uh, quite good for reading in. Um, and then a little zoomable light too. And it lets you turn it off without actually touching it, which is quite smart. Um, yeah, it's pretty useful. Uh, so in here, yeah, it's got some more GoPro bits. Um, ah, this one's pretty important. So this is just your all-in-one charger. So yeah that'll pretty much do everything I need in any country it's got two USB ports on the top as well um, you can plug anything in it again just get it on eBay um, but yeah it's nice and small um, the ones we got around the house are a lot bigger so I like that um, what's that That's my little uh, DIY GoPro time lapse 360 time lapse Yep, it's just some bits in there. Um, something good. Got claw to grab onto things with the GoPro. Right, then in here, ah, I got my SD cards in here, and uh, also got this little tile that my cousin gave me. 
Um, and I've already lost this thing in here. This is all my SD, micro SD cards. I've lost this once, only in my room, um, and it was a pain in the ass. So this little tile connects to my phone. Uh, the battery lasts a year, and um, yeah, you can start tracking it down um, through Bluetooth, and uh, it kind of plays a little tune. Um, yeah, and I think you can even if I if I drop it somewhere, it means that other people on the tile network can actually start tracking down and doing a little treasure hunt for my SD cards, um, which mean, mean a lot. I don't want to lose those. I'll lose the empty ones, that's fine. Right, I think that's everything in there. Um, yeah, just got all my travel documents um, and my passport in this. So I managed to pick up some, some little waterproof uh, cases from Amazon. I think it was about £2 for three of them come in different sizes, so I thought, yeah, that'll, that'll fit in there. Um, so they're safe. Keep that with me. Uh, what else have I got for you? Yeah, just some sunglasses. And, uh, yeah, this is my bag. The Mammoth Heron Crest. Uh, it's pretty good. It's got a nice pocket on the bottom um, and a separate section, so not all the stuff will fall down straight into the bottom. I can fill that up with, like, you know, your dirty washing or your wet stuff which makes it a lot easier and then you still get your other straps to uh, uh, your compression straps and other things if you want to uh, attach stuff to the sides it's all there and um, there's even a side zip so it's really easy to get in and out um, even with all these cubes it just makes it easier um, this whole top bit comes off and yeah you can uh, you can use that as a day bag uh, yeah it's pretty good reasonably uh, Breathable at the back, quite comfy. Yeah, pretty happy with it. It's nice, lightweight, small. Um, and then of course, yeah, got out the tunes and little X Mini. Thanks, Luke. Um, I think that's pretty much everything in my bag. Yeah, I think it is. All right. Cheers, guys. Um, I hope that was helpful. Oh wait, hang on. So, I've got some power cord. Probably won't take all of that, but yeah, I'll take some power cord to play with. Useful for you know um, washing line, um, or I'm hoping to do some trekking or whatever. You know, can actually start building a little uh, base with it, or uh, your shelter. Um, it's really handy stuff. You can do you can do thousands of things with this. Um, made myself, well, in the process of making myself a little. Uh, paracord bracelet. It's, um, it's even got a little fire starter on it. So if I go out with nothing but this, hopefully that means I should survive because you can undo that, use that for all sorts of things, and then yeah, start a fire with it. So always prepared. Um, yeah, duct tape is a good one as well. That's really useful stuff to have around. Um, fixed tears, even with the paracord for the sewing kit, I could um, I could repair. Any uh, any rips in that, and because uh, you can use the the inner the inner core of the paracord, it's really useful. Um, but I think that is officially it. Right. Okay. Thank you. Um, I'll see you soon.